get ready to take it to the octagon with Mike Kendall. These guys are really matched up well. They are. pounds brought to you tonight by AS Graphics and now introducing to you first fighting out the ASF Graphics Blue Corner this makes a martial artist stand six foot tall weight in 215 pounds with a professional record four wins two defeats with all four wins coming by way of knockout representing Ox Fitness and fighting out of Charlotte North Carolina Maurice the first Morris is opponent across the cage, fighting out of the wilder red corner. Is a K-1 style fighter standing six foot three, weighed in 215 pounds. Goes a professional record, three wins, one defeat, with all three wins coming by way of knockout. Representing Elevation Fight Team and fighting out of Denver, Colorado, by way of Minneapolis, Minnesota, Philip the Dr. Latu. Your referee, Steve Armstrong. Okay, gentlemen, you receive your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Obey my commands at all times. Touch gloves and good luck. Not touching gloves on this one. Here we go. Here we go. Maurice is ready for war, it looks like. Yes, but Philip Philip looks on shoot. Oh, yeah. Like what you were saying, Tyra, it doesn't matter about the war paint. It doesn't matter. No touching the gloves. Oh, a head kick. Maurice looks like he's already trying to take that back. Oh, oh a slam! Down. That's one of the dangerous things about throwing those spinning kicks and turning it back to your opponent. Philip is getting back up, defending that arm. He's turning into him. Ooh, underhook underneath the leg. He's a cross face and pick him up. There he goes. Maurice is really bent on this takedown. He is. Whoa! Oh. Philip throws some punches. Oh, there, some heavy, heavy punches from Maurice right there. <laughs> Here we go. Philip still trying to get that arm out. Maurice is getting lower, which is what he needs to do. He's grabbing that leg. He's looking for that takedown. Phillips doing oh. a good job cross-facing and working that underhook in. He's picking up that foot. He's pushing him against the fence. Yeah, Phillips is just too strong in the legs. Real tall. Phillips is doing a really good job of defending this uh, leg takedown, the single leg takedown. Controlling, it, controlling the head, ooh, brings in another knee. There's that kickboxing we were talking about. Yeah, he's a K1 Muay Thai kickboxing. specialist. We saw that even in the beginning when he went for that head kick. I think that's gonna play a factor ooh. here. Striking, there you go, Tyra. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, he goes for a jumping knee. Yeah, be careful there. It looks like Maurice has a lot of power, but Philip doesn't seem phased by it. Another knee. A K1 kit boxing really, really in Philip Latu's backpack. Ooh, another head kick. Going in for the strike. Oh! What do you think about that, Tyra? That's a nice hook. Connects. Maurice is getting a little, it seems like he's getting a little tired already. It yeah, that's does. A, that's the part when you fight for those takedowns and not get them. Oh, oh, it's oh, over with. It's a knockout. Wow. It's a knockout. Phil Latu. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I man. told you that K1 kickboxing was going to come into effect. K1 kickboxing, karate, kung fu, kickboxing, and kempo all wrapped in one. That was nasty. That was very nasty. Wow. Kimber. Wow, the fans are yeah, going yeah. absolutely crazy. I can't wait to see that replay. <laughs> Man, everyone's on their feet. Tyra, uh, you called it. You uh, said, doesn't matter about the war paint. Doesn't matter about the intimidation. It's how hungry the fighter is. 
And you can see that Phillip, he didn't let anything shake him. Let's look at this replay. Go ahead. Give it to us, Tyra. Like I said, Maurice with the gas. Ooh. Taking down that heat. Ugly. Yeah. That's the thing. Whenever you're going for takedowns, especially against someone that's really good at Muay Thai, right. he timed it perfectly. He, Maurice telegraphed it. He put his head down and just ate the knee. Yeah, you got to realize when you're wasting too much energy. Yeah, he, wa he walked right into it. Perfect. Oh, wow. He walked into it right there. Wow, on the side of the head, right in the mandibular joint, just bam. Uh, aside from that, I mean, yeah, th those are some nasty shots. I hope, I hope Maurice is okay. I hope everything's yes. fine. Yes, yes. They're working on him over there, but it, it, he's breathing. His head's up. He's sitting up. So I think he is all sitting is good. up. He's looking around. There was no love lost in that fight, though, from the beginning. No touch of the gloves. Oh, yeah, you, you can see that. Yeah. Maurice looked at him. He said, I, I ain't touching him. Phillips said, all right, let's get it there. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Maurice does look like he's okay. He's a little shook. He's getting up. Of course, we always want our fighters to be safe. Crowd showing respect. Philip Latu showing kickboxing, kickboxing respect. You know, I actually was watching, uh, you know, it was a kind of a funny TikTok, and they said, yeah, when you see that kickboxer, that's the guy you don't want to fight. Right. <laughs> that kickboxing is uh, yeah, something spe fierce. Especially on the Muay Thai level. I mean, it, it's a whole different whole different animal right yeah. there. I mean, yeah. you're using all eight limbs. You're throwing elbows. You're throwing knees, shins. You're using got, everything you get. No, I got little limbs. I got little <laughs> legs. I'm not kicking anyone. And, this, and the same goes for the elbows. Uh, you know, when you use your knee, that's cartilage. Oh, You're yeah, not feeling that. Yeah, and there's, a, I mean, it's a whole, whole different ball game from throwing a punch, even throwing a kick to, to whenever you really bring that knee up and put it through someone's head. I mean, it, that, that's a lot of force right there. You think about how much you can lift with your legs versus mm -hmm. what you throw with your hands. That's a, that's night and day right there. It's nasty. And the elbows and the knees are the hardest part of the body. Yeah. You know, uh, when it comes down, and so they're great for striking. Philip Henry, the doctor put on a clinic tonight did. with how to throw a Muay Thai knee. <laughs> if you ever wondered what Muay Thai was about, you just got a clinic from the doctor. <laughs> we'll take it to the octagon. What's your job, Foss? What do you think of that? Yeah. Your referee, Steve Armstrong, called the stop in this fight. Two minutes, 41 seconds, the very first round. Declaring a winner by knockout, yeah. Philip the Doctor. Holy smokes, man. That was very impressive. The, the arena went crazy. They written the replay, man. They're, they're, they're having it. I wish we could see it and I could show you the, the artistry of your work here in this first round of the co main event. Uh, give us your thoughts on the fight. Uh, he's a lot stronger than I expected. You know, props to him for coming in here with me. Uh, it was a short, short week, short notice. But uh, I got to give it to him for his strength. But uh, I mean, they call me the dog for a reason. I look for, look for those knockouts. So. Well, congratulations, man. Impressive, impressive coming out here to ECF1 with a dominant, you know, highlight reel knockout. Anybody you'd like to think that helped you prepare for this event? I'd like to thank my family, my friends. Um, I love you, Samantha, uh, all my coaches. And uh, yeah, that's basically it. Wichita Falls, Texas, put your hands together for this knockout artist, Philip, the Dr. Latu. Well, Tyra, you got your wish. We were talking about yeah. it. We wanted you to have a striking nice. <laughs> win right there. And uh, Philip Latu, like I said, the doctor was in the house. And yeah, I mean, he, we, we all know he's like, yeah, K1, K1 kickboxer, a Muay Thai I'm professional. The, the doctor putting on a clinic, but um, he, also, he also showed a lot of competency in, in wrestling. I mean, because yes. that, that wasn't easy. You could, you could tell how much strength Maurice had. I mean, he, he had him two or three times pressed up against the cage. Mm -hmm. I mean, he, he was working on him, changing levels the whole time. Philip had a straight face, smile on his face, kept working, pushing the head back up, underhooks, standing up, getting out, and then finishing the fight.